Good morning, Eagles. Today we have ASB Barstool, a segment rating Gen Alpha slang and weather with L'Oreal. Hold on tight, because this show is about a blast off. What's up, SM? I'm Callie Rangazalata. And I'm Sammy Duran. Let's start off with some announcements. The wrestling team wrestled at Esperanza last week and Vanguard this past weekend. At Esperanza, wrestling won eight out of nine medals for JV. Hunter Artem took first, Luke Linares and Jack Clemens took second, and B. Trong took third for varsity. Cameron Brown and Jack Clemens took second, and Hunter Artem, Wyatt Chandler, Dean Johnson, Hutt and Steele took third. At Vanguard, the teams won six out of seven medals. For, J for JV, JD Forsyth, Jack Clemens, and Luke Lenners took second and Peter Morsoff took third. For varsity, Cameron Brown took second and Hutton Steele took third. Keep up the good work, we're all proud of you. We are now in the second quarter of the first semester Eagles. It is a good time to check your gradebook and turn in any missing assignments. And congratulations to our Lady Eagle golfers who took first place yesterday at Great Oaks High School Invitational in Temecula. SM scored 360 against Olu's Tories Pines 363. It was a great team effort in a strong field of 20 teams. You know, I still feel like we're missing something. I think I know what it is. We have Addie and Emma here with us on ASB Barstool. Let's send it over. Good morning, Eagles. I'm Addie, your executive president. And I'm Emma, your executive vice president. We have Charism week, week this week. There will be activities and treats throughout the week for specific grades, and we have a couple special segments during ETV this week for it as well. Sophomores are invited to get ice cream today, followed by juniors on Thursday and seniors on Friday. There will be pizza and Jesus offered to juniors today, sophomores on Thursday, and freshmen on Friday. Charism Week is a great way students around campus can reflect on our four pillars, compassion, goodness, justice, and humility, and help us grow in our faith. Moving on, we have our food drive this entire week. Each class is designated a specific type of food to bring and can drop it off in the morning by the student store. Freshmen can bring canned fruit, sophomores may bring canned vegetables, juniors may bring jelly, and seniors can bring peanut butter. Donations will also add to Clash of Classes contests where the class with the most points will win a large prize at the end of the semester. Moving on, make sure you purchase your Eagle Pack tickets for our next football game this Friday. The game is against Olu and it is a away game. The theme is wear pink, so make sure you are spirited in supporting our football team. Eagle Pack offers a round trip bus ride from the school to the OCC Leverett Stadium. Make sure to meet at SM at 5 p.m. The tickets are $20 for ASB cardholders and $40 for non-ASB cardholders. Dinner will also be provided. Also, homecoming is next Friday starting at 7 p.m. and the theme is Hoko Roundup. That means that Hoko Spirit Week is also next week and the themes will revolve around a different country song every day. We are so excited to see everyone in their best country wear. Well, Sam, that's all we have for you today. I'm Maddie Matthews. And I'm Emma Gomez. Sending, sending it, it back, back to Sammy, Sammy and Callie. ASB Barstool always gets me ready for the week. Same here. If we didn't have it, I would feel so out of touch. Funny you say that because I've been feeling out of touch lately. Why is that, Sammy? There's so much slang and new terms popping up from the internet. Sometimes I don't even know what the little kids are saying. Well, that's why we have Tyler and Mason here and they rank Gen Alpha terms you've probably been hearing late lately. Let's watch it. Um, what the Sigma? What's up, chat? I'm Tyler Brummel. Today, my friend Mason and I are going to be ranking and describing Gen Alpha slang. That's right. Starting off, we have the word Sigma. This is an adjective that describes a person who puts monetary gains above everything else. For the ranking, Sigma is one of the better words. A tier. I agree, Tyler. Next, we have the word Alpha. This word means somebody who thinks that they're cool just because they can do something all by his or herself. This word is going to have to go into B tier. Moving on, we have the word Ohio. This word is a place where any and anything wacky happens. This word was used a few years ago, but has since grown old and annoying. C tier. Next, we have a very popular word. Riz is defined as W Riz or L Riz. W for win and L for loss. This word is the word of the year in 2023. It's also heard more than every other word on this list. It's going to go in S tier. Finally, we have the word skibbity. This word is used for filler when you don't know what to say. This word is the king of the brain rot terms. It deserves the very top of the list. S tier. That concludes our ranking today. Thanks for watching and sending it back to the host. Wow, um, I'd say that was pretty skibbity. <laughs> you know what has even more is? What? 
the weather it's finally starting to cool down you're so right and speaking of which i know that l'oreal is here to give us a further update Good morning, SM. I hope you guys enjoyed your guys' weather over the weekend and maybe even found yourself at the beach. As Callie and Sammy said, the weather is starting to cool down just a bit, but it is going to jump up as we head into the weekend. So today and tomorrow, we both have 74 and lows and 55. Wednesday and Thursday, partly cloudy skies. And as we head into the rest of the week, we're going to be staying in those low 70s with lows of 57 and 55. And as we head into the weekend, as I said, those numbers will start to jump up as Saturday we have a high of 75, low of 51. Sunday, a high of 78 and a low of 54. And finally, Monday, a high of 81 and a low of 56. I hope you guys find yourself at the pool or the beach this weekend. I'm Loria Blake, sending it back to Sammy and Callie. Fall weather is finally starting. I know, about time. Well, that's all I have for you today, Eagles. I'm Sammy Duran. And I'm Callie Rangenslada. Have a great week, SM.